what you really want to do. Because uh, I haven't been in years. I don't think it is possible to do all of Discovery Place in one day. Mm -hmm. so. uh, the, design, the dinosaurs end on September 8th. And what time? You'll get down here on what day? 5th. If you get here on the 5th? 6, 7, 8. Yeah, that's, that's probably not going to work. Yeah. Well, there's a moon thing. <clears throat> Chunk said he won't be home by one, but he will be here. Um, what the, the, the exhibition's just called Cool Stuff. The, what? There's also science, adult science stuff. And then, um, and this one I need to run by Looney and them too, but I thought I would run it by you first. Uh, there is escapology escape rooms here in Charlotte. Ooh, that could be fun. There's, uh, there's several of them. There's one that looks like it's based on Scooby-Doo. That sounds hilarious. Uh, there's also a mansion murder one, a Batman the Dark Knight one, a submarine one, a pirate's one. I need to look and see how expensive this fucking escape room thing is, though, before I get too f we get too far into this. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, we could buy the venue out for, for $5,000. And no, that ain't happening. I know. Uh, it's not terrible. It's not cheap, though, either. I'll have to... Do you guys not give a group discount? Provide one extra large pizza for every four so it was no. So it's basically fifty bucks per player. That's not horrible. I'll need to run by that that by Chonk and Movian. Yeah. Alright, time to get out of bed. Wow, Star Citizen. Running at 76 FPS on this station. No. Oh. Where's the Star Citizen? Do we want to try some more bounty hunting today? I am down for more bounty hunting today. Welcome to the ASOP Vehicle Retrieval System. Vehicle selected. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Please visit us again. Goodbye. And there's seven. I'm gonna go ahead and get the ship prepped. I'll probably just pick you up on a pad. Mm -hmm. Or did we end up at the same place yesterday after the game went? all insane on us? Uh, probably? I can't remember. And we'll do bowling and arcade games and stuff one night at Sports Connection and that won't cost us anything. Except for any food we get. Mm -hmm. Thanks to uh, Michael. 
Mustad is the best. Yeah. And Star Search just crashed on launching, but that could be because I tried to tab out to look at more of this website. Probably. Let me open it on my phone. I'm up in a way. Thank you. And please visit again. But I'm just hanging around the station, so I'll just wait on you. Oh, defense turrets are going apeshit on somebody. Yep. I got whipped too, so... It was scary. Yeah. Well, that's the only thing I can... Is there that or I see something in the Ocean View Motel? Knight just posted something in the Ocean View Motel earlier. About weird shit he sends to um, people who try to get him for art. There's something wrong with that boy. Nitrous? Mm. Yes. There is a Titan Avenger in the commons at New Babbage. Okay, like landed by the commons or in the commons? I assume why he says, it, like if it was just at the commons, it wouldn't be notable. Uh, well, you mind. never know what is notable to players in this game. I'm at Everest. Accept. So are you? Oh, well, just go up to a pad and let me know which one, and I'll come pick you up. All right. No, I. I go to pad and I go to the ASOP terminal and I'm like, nope, this isn't where I get pads. Nope. nope I don't need no, these things. Not. Let's go to pad one. Just watched you zip straight across space and disappear for a second. I'm magic like that. Oh, there is a um, Avenger, I think that's an Avenger here. 
Hell it be up, whatever it is. Let me just uh, close those tabs and pull up stream. But yeah, that zoo looks really, that zoo, that science center looks really, done sort of really cool fun things. Might have to wait to a bit close to see what exactly is exhibitions and stuff on whilst I'm over there. Yeah, Discovery Place is fun. Come on, let me on the thing, thank you. In the turret. Contract shared. Accepted it. Take off. Barney Wilkes. Eight ninety, that's probably the target, even if it hasn't registered yet. Mm -hmm. Uh, That's two six hundreds. Yep. What's the other one? I think it's three six hundreds actually. Yeah, I think it is, which is really silly. Yep. Yes, no, I'm hitting it seven kilometers out. <laughs>
I ran through all my power. Yeah, you're gonna have to recharge. I can't divert from shields with this much shit around us. Of course. shooting us. Piss off. Wait, you're not all shooting us. Mm. You what the fuck? Alright, we need to kill these other things if this thing survives impact. Did you already kill another? No. Oh, this guy's just showing up. Okay, he wasn't showing a name. The Sig 90's got 22 SCU of gas in the light line. Oh boy, yes. The 890 even falling was a soft kill that bad. That I don't know. Weapons system critical. Weapons system critical. Weapons system critical. Enemy down. And it does not appear to be falling. Dennis? Yep. Right. Sure, I don't hear your turret firing right now. Oh, I'm firing. I know you are. I just don't hear the noise for it. <laughs> oh, well, God, the ship's pinging about for me. Yeah, we got some. What do we do about this? I don't know. Have you got any entrances I can get into from the top of it? I can jump into it? Oh, it's still on the hangar. I can jump in the hangar thing, yeah, can't I? Everybody's open. This is real sketch. 
I'm gonna go on down to the cargo bay, because I don't want to lower yep. the main elevator. Whoa! What? There's still someone in the turrets. That means I can drop you, but you're gonna have to be real quick about it. Alright. The ladder. Okay, get in the bottom of it, but don't open it yet. I am in the middle of the cargo bay. I have a gun out. Right. Drop it. Game, how do I push the button? Oh. The button isn't where the panel is. Yes, of course not. Okay, I'm in. I'm not being shot at. This is super sketchy. I do not like this. Hmm, I don't... Uh, wait, what, what should I be doing? Landing it? Oh, could you fly it? I don't know. I will make my way to the bridge and find out. Oh, there's a basketball hoop here. I can remember how to get my way around this ship. That's an airlock. Bridge is in that main room with the double staircase on either side. And that's the axis. in there? I'm... Uh... You're looking for a central... Found, huh? Found the med bed. Are you looking for oh. a central hallway that goes all the way across the width of the ship? It'll have an airlock on either end. In the middle of that is the access to the bridge and the cargo bay. Yeah, I need to... Well, the other elevators are working. Why isn't this one working? You should oh, need to be taking an elevator to get to the bridge. At least I don't think so. On the bridge. I doubt you're gonna be able to pilot this thing. Wait, is this a I think I can go in the pilot seat. Yeah, Let's I see it. The eight ninety has a captain's chair too. You wanna make sure you're in the pilot seat.
No way. I am well, do not go land it near those other ships down there. We are that's gonna be on private property. We need to land basically straight down. I can do straight down. And you have a key bound to open everything up, right? I do. Alright, so we just smeared the pilot and didn't do very much damage to that ship, huh? It appears so. That thing has got quite the set of landing gear. Might want to move forward. Some of you are going to be on some rocks. They might or just smash her onto the ground. It's really hard to tell from this pilot seat how far up they are. How far up I am. I I, to if you could lift up and hop forward a little bit, that would be great. Like, just head straight towards that other wreck in front of you. No, Ben, Ooh. I need you to move a good bit more than that. Yeah, I'm trying. It does have a bit of a talking balance. <laughs> Rub her on the ground until she... God, this is so fucking rocky. That's looking a little better, though. Apparently, I'm trespassing. Hmm, you're just over the... Th oh, I am too. Should I move uh, it again? No, let's just get this thing unloaded as quick as we can. Alright. Why am I being shot? Because there's still people in the turrets, I think. I tried to enter the turret, it wouldn't let me. Also... Oh god, bits of the ship aren't existing for me. in a couple of minutes with a county. Can you just go turn the power to that ship off? Oh, yeah.
And I'm on area 18. You got that thing powered down? I don't know. I think so. I mean, I you, know how to, in the pilot seat. you know how to power down a ship, so. Yeah, like I did that. You know what you could do, just in case? What? Is you could go down to the cargo bay and chuck all the good shit out the back. Yeah. And then move that thing. Yeah. Understandable. I mean, how many did we have yesterday? 14, and it was half a million. Yeah. Yeah. Plus, I want my shit back. Understandable. Vehicle retrieval system. We hope you have safe travels. Your insurance claim has been sent. Thank you. Four minutes. Please visit us again. Goodbye. I'm sure this will give you uh, time to check that shit out the back of it. If I can figure out how, if it's going to let me off it in any reasonable way. What do you mean? It won't let me call any of the external elevators. Yeah. Uh, you may have to. Well, is that a low grav moon or not? I don't know. Wait, is that a moon or are we on Hurston there? Um, yeah, we're on Hurston there. Now, you probably don't want to try to make that jump. It might kill you. Yep. I'm going to turn it back on and call the cargo elevator up. You do know how to get to that, right? Yep. Nineties are so frustrating. Yep. Want your company to be in good company? Our Corp's unique vertically integrated corporate parks offer amenities such as resource sharing and logistical pairing for our rental partners. Inquire today to learn how you can invest in making our Corp your new home. But hey, I'm learning my way around one now. Hi. The vehicle terminal should handle that. Welcome to the well, I mean, ASOP vehicle I guess some retrieval is coming system. Up this, Please be aware that while in the Stanton system and on our corp, all UEE common laws are still in effect. I mean, I do have other cargo ships I could have come down there with, but it just doesn't seem worth it. Yeah. Like, we could, probably could have fit everything in the cuddy, but... Want your company to be in good company? Our corpse also, the Andromeda's got my fastest drive in it, so it'll still be probably the quickest way to get back to you, even with the claim time. I should check there's nothing valuable in the hangar, too. Uh, I guess there... Hello, and welcome. 
Welcome to Riker Memorial Space Please Force. visit us again. Servicing the Goodbye. greater Area 18 metropolitan area. We hope you have safe travels wherever your final destination may be. This man just said Orison does not doesn't have a ship shop. Uh, I mean it does. So it's just a titanium in the forward. Okay, cool. Back to the back of the ship. Company, our corp's unique vertically integrated corporate parks offer amenities such as resource sharing and logistical pairing for our rental partners. Inquire today to learn how you can invest in making our corp your new home. Vehicle retrieval system. Whatever your transaction, please we visit us again. Goodbye. Stay. Oh, these people. Welcome right. to the ASOC Vehicle Retrieval here. System. 20 seconds. Yeah, I'm still arguing with elevators. <laughs> For the latest travel information. Be sure to check the departure and arrival boards, conveniently located throughout the spaceport. I mean, what's what's happening? Are you just there is a ladder inside that Vehicle ship that'll let you down to the main Standby. bay. It's in the same yeah, way as the elevator that goes to it. Visit us again. I can get to the main bay, it's getting out of the main bay and onto the ground of the planet. Well, does the fall look that like it's gonna kill you? Uh, I can't fall. There's a glass. In, there's a glass cover over the hole. Have you gone back up to the bridge? Powered her back on, and yep. All the other elevators are working, just not the external ones. I could jump out the side airlocks, but well, I mean, you might have to. Yep. I just, I would like that thing to be powered down so the turrets can't shoot me. Yeah, I'll power it down before I jump outside the airlocks. Airlock on a lower floor, maybe. Oh, those too high. Oh, those are very high. They're on the same level as the little bridge room. I think there's lower down ones. Hairston's obstructed.
marker. Well, the other thing I could do is just fly it in, out of atmosphere. You could. Save breaking my legs. Yeah. It'll give you a little time to deal with getting the cargo off while I go pick up my body. Yep. And it'll get you out of that trespassing zone. Yep. I wish we could just sell straight from it, like we had just, you know, like if you would pirate a ship and go sell from it, but we can't, because that would have just would've made getting rid of those eggs so much easier. Yep. See you moving. Yep. Let's just hope my body's actually there. Yeah, I've not been able to look because, you know, I've been stuck inside this ship. <laughs> real mess around here. And there's a mustache to begin with. We just added to it.
on the ground. I jump for an orbit orbital marker, or so I keep flying straight up till I lose altitude. I would just keep flying straight up till you lose the altitude. There's a chance that somebody else right. might jump into an orbital marker with you. If that's my body, it's a long ways from the wreck. Yep, that's my body. I'm a good hundred meters from the wreck. <laughs> wow. Mm. I find lost altitude. Now just to wait for the thing to stop. Where's I could space break. Hmm. It don't slow down very efficiently. I have come to a stop. I'm going to power off engines, power off ship. We'll find out if that does what we want it to when I get up there. I also left it in um, QCM. Oh, nice. So they should, if they follow the same rules everybody else has to, they shouldn't be able to use their guns now. Oh, I, did I? I forgot I might have closed the things to take off. straight into the sun. Yep. Alright, that's the elevator going down. Wait, there's not even any corpses up here. Talk to him. I mean, might as well bring it. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'm gonna open the cargo bay and then you kind of guide me in. I can't get too close to this thing. I know. Well, I suppose I could flip it upside down.
I appear to have made a box angry somewhere. Would this be easier if I switch sides so that that elevator's not in our way? No, there's even less, um... Anything on the other side. Right, how's this? That's good. You want me to come down to the cargo bay and help? Uh... No, I'm just dealing with some angry physics at the moment. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about, is you've got shit going everywhere and I don't want to get... Oh, God. Don't move anything onto the ship right now. I'm not. There's space cop here. I'm pushing stuff away. Yes, condom. Alright, that one on scan in progress went away. garbage off that thing first. Can we close this Yeah. Lift? That's the lift I was having problems with opening, but you can try. Titanium. Corundum. Oh, you finally got one free. Yeah, I've got the weevil eggs. Oh, there they all are. Like that. There we go. There's more weaver legs at the bottom of that stack. Target that That's box. a big altrusia toxin. Yep. That one up, whatever it is. Oi, that one. What's the one I just moved? Yeah, I don't know what that is. It's Altrusia Toxin. Oh, there's two big Altrusia Toxins? Yeah. Jesus. Ah! Uh, Alright. Uh, where's the other big Weevil Egg box? You know, I don't think we can fit all of this in here. Um, well, we can try. The Altrusia Toxin is obviously the... Where's that? Or the uh, Weevil Eggs are obviously the big thing. Have we just got the... Also, if we... You know, pack it properly. Alright. Get that? 
Is out here? Uh, another huge Arcusia toxin. Attached to the grid, that's lovely. Yeah, I can move some stuff. What I was gonna see was can we stack that big box on, on top, top of the other big box? Yeah, so pull. Uh, we'll leave those. I don't think, I don't think so, because they built us. Yeah, because it would. Okay. So if we can. Oh no, because that's a too long. Hmm. Um, you know what we can do? Is hold on, leave those, put that back, and move that one, those two over on top of that other one. I wish I could interact with things that would make this so much easier right now. Pull that out the back. Oh, I see. I see what you're doing. Boy, I wish I had my max lift. This is painful with the uh, multi tool. I can imagine. do this. I'm going to let go of it. far. That's that's entirely too far. It was... Oh. oh, is that thing the entire length of the fucking cargo bay? It appears so. Hang on. It is entire, the entire length of the cargo bay. And now my thrusters have stopped working. Weird. That's super fucking frustrating. I mean, how... 
How much do you feel like jamming it in here with without snapping it? Uh, I don't. I'm pretty skeptical of that. Yep. Also, I can't. There you go, that's snapped to the grid now. Or did you not want it snapped to the grid? I mean, it's not going to go any further back. No, but I mean, in terms of money, we kind of would rather have the uh, weevil eggs. Yeah, worth I mean, uh, I'll get rid of, hang on, I'll put these over here and we'll get rid of the smaller altruistia toxin. Ah, I've been murdered. Right. Well, that's as good as that's gonna get. Yep. Bit unfortunate, but oh, you jumped! You just gonna get in through the side there, Luck? Yeah. Last time I went up the car a fully laden car cargo elevator like that, I got pushed through the side of the ship. Gotcha. <coughs> I mean, you could fit it in the middle there, but. I don't trust it not to blow the ship up. Yep. <laughs> oh, that's... this is going to be profitable. What? Selling all of these weevil eggs and the Trucia toxin? Uh, yeah? Why did you think I was so fucking determined to get our hands on it? I know. And I got to fly an 890. I'm very surprised that it was flyable. We must have just obliterated the pilot without having done much else to the ship. Uh huh. Tons of Etrusia toxin was that we just had to leave behind. Or Sixteen or thirty-two, twenty-four. A lot. The biggest box was the thirty-two. So that was a sixteen. No, it was bigger than a sixteen. So sixteen is two. It was a free long, so it'd be in a twenty-four. Ah. I think. Starlifter, a couple busted up Starlifters down here. They usually are.
That's a very upside down C2. And some vultures. <laughs> Why? This is not the time for you to start lagging out, server. I'm on the elevator. I, I am too. I hit the button a few seconds ago. Yeah. Alright, make sure this, this thing closes behind us. Yep. Point four. Junk's missing out. Yeah, but we don't have to share this with him either. Exactly. <laughs> Done. Also, in no time if we keep getting those today. You need a lux break. Get in the top turret, not the bottom turret. I don't blame him. Accepting, sharing. Accepting.
I need some orbital markers on this one, it looks like. I wish you could just route to orbital markers on the map. Me too. Game, I don't need to jump to Hurston. I'm already on. Hurston. I hate it when it does that. Yeah, sometimes the nav is really frustrating. There's an old You know, it's actually cold enough today that I had to put my UDI on. No, oh, how many degrees Celsius was that? Ten. Just what in Fahrenheit? Fifty. It's been really wet and windy all day. Hmm. Let me ask if I should put a load of laundry on. Eh, I can wait. Fucking hell, there is nothing near this guy. Like, legitimately nothing. I almost want to abandon this because I don't feel like waiting up that flight. Let me put us in cruise and look at the map again. The closest thing to him is HDMS Operai. Let's jump there and see what happens. But I think it's still going to be a ball egg. Yeah, you could try cutting it early, but I don't know, it doesn't always work for you. What do you use to try to cut it? Uh, power. Huh. It just does not do anything. I think part of that is the cut, the Connies have a bug where they will not power down sometimes. Yeah.
This isn't that bad. Let me get us up to full speed. Yeah, remember to uh, make sure you gain enough altitude that we're not slowed by atmosphere. Yep, notice that we're climbing now. Yep. You adjusted in the time it took my thought to come out my mouth. Uh, you should have quite right. the pretty view out of your uh, turret. Uh, it's probably prettier for you because you have clouds and I have clouds turned way down. Ah. Because... Probably one of the thing, you know. Clouds are one of those things that like to eat if frames. They do. Oh yeah, I need to tap out and check something. There we go, now we're picking up the pace. Alright, let me know when we get close, because I'm tapped out. Yep, no problem. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's very pretty. Oh yeah, that's pretty on stream. Out. Oh god. Don't do that. <laughs> That's fine. I would have been fine actually. We're on cruise cruise control and level. Bex and I actually watched some of the Olympics last night. Ooh, I've been watching the equestrian stuff. Uh, she might be watching it now. We want to watch the um, gymnastic stuff together, so we're waiting until tonight when they replay it. Uh, um, I watched the opening ceremony. That is a glorious. Republicans will hate it, and that's all I'm going to say on that matter. <laughs> but, yeah, there was... A drag show and many other things. And a very friendly. And a man in a blue, painted blue. And an Assassin's Creed character. Yep. What did you watch? Like opening ceremonies on one of your channels or an American channel? Uh, it no, it's a. I think yeah, it was. I've done it by subscribing to Discovery Plus, which gives me Eurosport 1. Okay, so you didn't have the American uh, commentators? No, I had a pair of British commentators. Oh, okay, because we had Kelly Clarkson and Peyton Manning. Yep, wow. A uh, singer and a football guy. I mean, most of the British coverage is by ex-athletes, but I don't think there was ex-athletes on the... I mean, a lot of ours is done by actually... I. You need to look up Snoop Dogg at the Olympics, though. I know I've seen that he shit. He is there, and it is hilarious. Like, I, I can't watch the if, next time they do the Olympics. If Snoop's not there, I'm not going to be able to watch. <laughs> that is hilarious. He was talking to the Simone Biles family, the American gymnast. Oh, I. And he's like, he's like, where is she? She's like, she. They're like, she's resting because she has to compete tomorrow. He's like, get her on Facetime, and like pulls out his phone. I Meanwhile, mean, the British are like, on like, looking at him, he's like, well, some of them will be here at the opening ceremony. Some of them, of course, will be resting for their events tomorrow. And that's always the conundrum of Olympic athletes, whether you go to the ceremony or not. And there was one point last night where they showed the whole U.S. women's gymnastics team was like looking in the stands and pointing and they panned over and Snoop was just there in a full like American flag jumpsuit just dancing with his hands up. 
I'll try to find some choice clips and send them to you later. They're good. Chonk also just said home in an hour. Let him know that we didn't wait on him to sell the eggs. <laughs> Are you just showing him how many eggs we got? I showed him, I put a <laughs> screenshot in there. Yeah, because I was watching the cross country earlier. Mm. Because the way it's working on Eurosport and Discovery Plus is as soon as the live stream's ended, you can re start re watching it again. Yeah. Which is useful because all the equestrian stuff happens starts at like 8 a.m. and I'm not changing my sleep schedule. Mm. So I was watching the um, cross country and because of the guy doing the commentating, sort of deal venting, I can't remember who it was, but he, he always, he's like you're saying, they're taking this path, because in cross country you can choose which path you take, and there's a ditch there, and I don't think the horse is going to have time to see it. Here about five horses later, one of them falls in the ditch. Nice. He's like, I did say that. And then he was berating another competitor saying he's looking at the bottom of the fences and if you black the way you look that's what you're going to end up you need to look ahead of them about three jumps later he miss uh, paces the horse and ends up at the bottom of the jump good job but also I like watching the pretty horses mm. I don't not so much the dressage but I do enjoy the Cross country and then the show jumping sun too. Dress such is boring as shit. It can be the freestyle can be entertaining because it's they get to choose their music and their performances. But yeah. And it's all about restricting how the horse moves. Whilst cross country and show jumping are just about go fast, jump over big things. Oh no, we're at 75% hydrogen fuel. No, no. Uh, also, if you're still tapped out, we are diving down now. We're at 64 kilometers out. Alright, and back in. Yeah, and shit. So I got a phone call earlier saying I'd won 250 quid, and I wanted to see how it, if it, where it appeared, and it hasn't appeared yet. Or if it's a scam. I don't think it's a scam. It's part of the um this Google thing I'm a part of where they watch your internet um, activity and then they give you vouchers. Ah, you're letting the Googlies spy on you like super seriously. Yeah. I mean, if they're going to give you money for it. Yeah. I mean, I've got like a hundred pounds of points saved up at the moment. And I could use them on Amazon or Argos. That's right. We are in guns. I am here and ready. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna cash them out shortly and buy myself a bigger book, okay? I also need to email the people who are meant to deliver my desk, because it's been two weeks now and they haven't delivered it. Yeah, might want to find out where it is. Mm. Yep. 
Redeemer. Six hundred I. Looks like two star lifters, an M2 and a C2. Yep, I got a C2 and it's the M2. That Redeemer's gonna go first. Okay. And not only is he the target, he's the biggest threat. Yep. The M2 and C2 might have some juicy insides though. Yeah, we'll have to see. Also, we're a little high up, so... Mm-hmm. You got just enough time to ban that person before we open fire. Now you ask your outfit, you're going to have to wait until after this combat. Yeah, you're going to have to wait five minutes. It's so weird, all the ships are just sort of parked there in mid-air waiting to be turned on, I guess. Yeah. There they go. There's some more clips here. I think another bounty just spawned. Yep. Yeah, there's a bounty just spawned. Yeah, there's a bounty just Gonna pull up? Or you just gonna park down there? Oh no, we can't take a whole lot. Okay, stop. There's a cutty down there. Yeah, I can tell there's a cutty down there. It's eating our ass and alive right now. How quick they're still within 2k of us. I'm accelerating now. Right, yeah, outside so 5k. We need a quick trip to Everest. That hurt. Yeah.
Then you're asking to go out. If you found something to chew with, you need to need to go out. What are you chewing? What you got? You're hiding in the corner now, and your tail's tucked under you. Got something he shouldn't have. Yes, he's got a bag of treats, you little shit. Go Where did you find that? Go deal with him. We're going to take a break anyways. Fucking dog. Suddenly Chester's outside my gate whining. Buddy boy, I can't come get you right now. Give me just a minute. What's up, little man? I'm literally just about to get up and take a break in the next, like, 30 seconds. won't power off, so I think that may be part of what I'm having issues with, with trying to get those jumps. Repair, repair, refuel, refuel. Alright, everybody out, so we don't get smacked with a, uh, whatchamacallit. Impound. That man talking about amphibious landings for ships and like what 890 love owners would love to do is dead on. Oh yeah. Like Space Jeff Bezos would totally go to an ocean world and just land and have a giant yacht party. But it's not like an unheard of thing in science fiction too. I mean if you think about Cowboy Bebop, they primarily land in water. Like their mm -hmm. ports in that show are all around water. I mean, it makes sense, because you need water to live. Hmm. I need to watch more of that. And there's always a big... I don't know how many times I show it. I know they show it several Welcome times, but the, uh, the, the Bebop system. has a bunch of ports that close up over its engines and stuff when it again. lands. Mm -hmm. Alright, folks, we'll be back in a few minutes. Bye.
to your gremlin chair you go. Good gremlin dog. Yes, good gremlin dog. Can't wait till Bennis is here. She can see how you gremlin. Yo, oh, his gremlin is going to be adorable. All right. Contracts. How are you doing on your rank? Uh, let me check. Uh, 72.5. Okay, I've got another contract. Let me know when you're ready to share. Ready. Got it. What a crab tree. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. Vehicle selected. Your vehicle has been Thanks. delivered to the We are good to go. Up and away. I can get us pretty close, it's too much for a moment. Nice. Thanks to the In the Wake of Disaster mission.
There we go. Passing a random ship here on our left. I see it. Not very big, whatever it is. Shut up, Chester. Wow. Hey, it works. This planet's very pretty, or at least this angle of it, with the mountains. It really is. I swear the dog looks like a little goth kid when he does this. <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong. <laughs> oh, Chester. He won't know what hit him. Coming up on 25 kilometers, I'll drop to uh, SCM at 20. Mm -hmm. I wonder if this man's got any apples. They're probably crab apples, though. Yeah, they're nice. That's Star it. M2. Did I say we claim more Redeemer? Redeemer. Ah, oh, fuck. We got a Connie Phoenix. Connie. Yeah. Um, 600 I. Focus the Connie? Yes, focus the Connie. Connie's in the Redeemer. Ghost. There's the Redeemer. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna be backing up for just a minute. So mm -hmm. Mm-hmm.
down goes to the It may not survive. We're at almost five kilometers. Shields damaged. So Rattlers. Target acquired. I'm shooting the thing that's in range. Just the 600 eye, I think. Pass there, bud. Oh, there he goes, bits of him. Keep hammering him. Yep. There's the rest of him. The NPCs are far too good at um, flying the ship when bits fall off. I don't think there's many thrusters in the wings of that thing. Uh. 600? Yep. Say that I'm shooting stuff. But maybe there's 600. There go the rattlers. Where's Chunk with his torpedo boat? See if you've got any tasty Rawlings Carrigan. Is it stuck? It appears to be. <laughs> I don't think the AI can figure out how to get out of the predicament it's put itself in. I've I've never seen anything like this. Cruise control, please go off. Whoop. I've lost control. 
the ship. Stop. Okay. Speed limiter, please do what I'm trying to tell you to do. There we go. Now that the speed limiter has finally responded, we should be able to just hang out right here. Weapons system Hundred I also survived. Land then and use our own eyeballs. Land where? the main elevator. I'm going to stay on just in case it pogos us. Yep. Oh, no, you didn't even touch the ground. Now, the other problem you're likely to have is that back cargo bay is likely blown by a panel. Oh, now nope. it's scanning. Nope, still fucking up. Anything? No, no, yeah, it hasn't opened. Oh god, it's gonna kill me. I don't see anything, but... Jump over the floating rocks. Nada. I'm actually kind of okay with that. Lo unloading that thing looks super fucking sketchy if they're doing anything on it. Mm -hmm. oh, back on board you get. Are you okay over there? I'm under the ship. Why? To open your elevator. Oh, under my ship. For me, you're still under the, uh... You're still under the, uh, M2 over there. Now yeah. you've moved. Alright, you good? I mean, that'd explain why the elevator wasn't working and opening up for me. But yes, I am good. I am back aboard. I am back in my bip turret. This whole area is sketchy as well. Turn off my flashlight. Actually, it's not too bad in here with the flashlight on. And it's kind of annoying.
All right. Not getting in this thing anyways. <laughs> well, that was uh, interesting. still see the docking collar and stuff from that Connie I lost at the beginning of the stream. <laughs> yeah, I just accept that there's always docking collar and markers around. Yeah. Maybe one of these days I'll fix it. Mm -hmm. Are you on? Stop that. Nice. I, I wish I could. No, ever is no, it's shooting at anybody anymore. It's doing that desinky thing for me. Music is skipping for me. Like skipping like a CD. Oz. Hey. Lord Rusk, or Lloyd Rusk. Lord Rusk sounded better. Accepted it.
Restock, please. Till we go. Jose Skolnick, huh? I was able to cut that one a little short, but not by much. We were 80 kilometers out when it dropped from the uh, orbital marker. Mm -hmm. so, it helped. Not a lot, but it helped. Definitely helping my Hurston rep. That's why not. I just knocked the shit off my desk. Uh, rep. Let's see. Hurston. No, it's at 24.9. Uh, well, what's your bounty hunters? Yeah. Bounty hunters at 73.7. Does I'm just under halfway through the veteran guild member okay, cool. um, thing. Because that's what should give you your next your cert. Mhm. Mm well, so veteran yeah, guild steward is the only thing left. So when that pops over. This is when I think you should get the next contract. Fuck, who all like me the most? I've got 34.8% with them. Hmm. My protects like me the least. I've only got 3.5%. Well, that's because they're a whole cabbage city. Yeah. Okay, that was concerning for a minute there. I couldn't stop our fall for a second. Oh, well, you've nearly... you made me gray out. Yeah, I made me gray out, too. 
So I figured Jim and I Hammerhead, Corsair, and a Starfare. Ugh. Let's see if we can get the Corsair out of our hair first. Alright. They haven't turned on yet. Yeah, I see that. Wait, is that a hammerhead is our main target? Yes. Yeah, okay. Of course, they're out of our way, and then we can deal with the uh, hammerhead. Mm-hmm. Because the rest of his buddy is not going to They're two star figures. There's not that much fire. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, if you soft kill a ship and you can still fly it like we've got that 890, you should be able to fly it to like a breaker's yard mm -hmm. and sell it. Yeah, I was talking to Lenny about that today. It should be like space chop shops. Yep. Oh, wait. So, just hit us. I don't have line of sight on the 890. Not the 890, sorry, the Corsair. Oh, actually, my target switched to the... What? There we go. For some reason, my target switched and I hadn't changed it. It doesn't do what it did to Chunk the other day. Oh god. Just initiate hyper mode. Thank you. 
Go out that far, I'll fire the last four marksmen at you. Pretty red. There we go. You're going to have to do most of the work on these starfares. We should have a chunk soon. to your guns. I am out of ordnance completely. Wait. What? Take a comically long time. Did that hammerhead even survive? I don't see any other marks. You get lucky, Starfire. Yep.
me. Oh, a direct jump to Everest, supposedly. Let's see how that works out. That's a lot of ammo I just expended. I'm a head. <laughs> Landing why is it always Hangar 5? And why are there guns still shooting something? You see that, right? Yep. I mean, there's a ship in that vague direction, but... We just blow up. I don't know. Oh, I see. The game thinks we hit something. Ah, yes. Well, we're reading our Mr. Zone. Do I keep my shit? I hope so. Chester, why did you just kill us? Doesn't look like it. Should be able to get our stuff back though. Yeah, I definitely didn't keep my gear, did you? I don't know, I'm waiting for the waiting group to um, figure it shit out. Oh yeah, I've got my gear. Do you? Well, maybe mine's just bugging a little bit. Because my back, I've only got the one backpack, so maybe it's just bugging and not showing me that it's full of my stuff. No, no, I, I don't have my stuff. 
Strange. Back to ever as we go. Mm hmm. There's a ghost dime bot in this elevator. There's some lag in this elevator. Mm -hmm. Fellow marshmallow man on the tram. Yay. You're invisible. So is your marshmallow friend. No, I'm invisible to you. Lovely. to my screen you're here and you're in a beacon suit the scrub suit oh I am in the scrub suit oh because when you got on the train you were in armor I changed it so, so I could get my other armor back Chonky Tron's fault. Oops. When in doubt, blame Chonk. I do. Never blame Bit. He is Chonky and not here to defend himself, therefore it is, is his fault. Mm -hmm. Despite the fact saying he would be here. he be Chonky. He's probably getting a chimichangas. If you prick him, he bleeds chimichanga. Hello, friends! <laughs> <laughs> Speak and he shall appear! Right? Talk about him and his chongas and he shows up. That's yes. Does he have chongas? No. Well, he does. They're just inside. <laughs> his veins. Deep within his veins. In the freezer. Bennett's got to fly an 890 today. Immigration. That thing does not like to take off. No. Why did you get to fly an 890? It was a bounty target. It's the one that we cut all the uh, eggs off of. Um, we it, we saw killed it, and then we proceeded to kill all the rest of the uh, targets, because I had scanned it in the middle of the fight and wanted those eggs. Yeah. Turns out that we barely did any damage to it. We just wrecked the cockpit and the pilot. So ben was able to drop off my cargo bay into its hangar bay, go up to the cockpit, and fly it up into orbit. Neat. Because we noticed it wasn't I mean, falling, it just went into station keeping mode when we killed the pilot. Yeah. I mean, I tried landing it, but then I realized I couldn't. it wouldn't let me off without jumping out on the side airlocks. We were on Hurston. The elevators weren't working? No. 
the internal elevator was working, and the I could <coughs> tell the elevators to go down with the open all button, but couldn't pull, ask them to come back up or move them at all from the panels. Oh, weird. Yeah, they were being buggy. That's why I flew it back up into space so I could just fly out of the side airlocks. After I had to go back because I uh, didn't realize when I landed behind it that fuck, one of the turret gunners was still alive and I didn't get clear in time. Yeah. So. Apparently, though, the at least we have confirmation the NPCs are bound by the same rules we are because when Ben got it in orbit, she left it in nav mode and powered it down and they couldn't shoot at us. Welcome hey. to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Conversely though, they don't exist because she went and looked in the turrets and there was nobody there. I couldn't no. The turrets are like locked in their occupied position so I can like cool it down. Uh you made it sound like there was nobody in them, my my misunderstanding. There was nobody yeah, so that else. Means on there the was ship. somebody in them. Like, I couldn't find anyone in, like, any dead bodies or anything. I want to be able to, like, get on the outside of a ship and just, like, cut a little hole in a turret glass and throw a grenade in. Don't give them any ideas. The game will be in development for another two years because of that one idea. Right. <laughs> Our glass cutter tech, we have to perfect it. It'll take at least a decade. Why is the Connie Andromeda's location unknown? The well, last just blew up. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Yeah, ours went. Expedite. Ours went pop at Everest. Oh, lovely. I'm definitely gonna get interrupted at some point for helping with groceries. Probably very soon. Groceries. Groceries. Goodbye. It's still telling me you're 13 kilometers away. I'm 3.8 meters away. You're violating my personal bubble. Stop. To the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Tap. Continuous guest. I need to schedule my car's 30,000 mile service. Which it is 8,000 miles overdue for. Good lord, dude. You know how hard it is to get service scheduled when they don't do weekends? Oh, yeah. I can imagine. They need to uh, step up their game and do weekends. It would help a fucking lot. But they're just like, hanger for. Not, not dog. We don't do Saturdays and Sundays. Suddenly, Bennis emerges from the floor. That was weird looking. Where I live, I'm but in your floors. Thank you for ah. visiting our corp, Stanton's capital of commerce. Whatever your transaction, we Goodbye, Venus. Goodbye, Dinebot. Now oh, you're back. Good boop. They're trying real fucking hard to make sure that 324 isn't busted as hell. Mm, it's still gonna be busted they're... as hell. Well, they what they have to do is make sure that the hangers work. That's the main mm -hmm. thing. Is that the hangers have to function, otherwise the game does not function. The issue they were having before that was the big one, I don't know if they're still having it, was that the personal hangers, specifically, not all the hangers, personal hangers, 
we're having difficulty opening from either the outside or the inside. They're not going to publish another Evo build today, but they're going to make a build tomorrow. Interesting. <laughs> Good party invite. Yep. Scheduled my service for Friday at 3 p.m. I should be home before then on Friday. Working local. Good luck, sir. Reading through the testing chat uh, earlier, evidently their plan for armor in seats is that heavy and medium armor will not be wearable in pilot seats, or in ship seats in general. Huh. Light armor and uh, under suits will be fine. What about, like, the exploration armor that is an undersuit and armor in one? Doubt. Too big. It is very big. have to put it in a... Uh, a suit rack whenever they actually implement those. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we actually, uh, I don't know if you saw, we had to leave some stuff behind out of that 890 because the containers were too fucking big to get everything into the Connie. Yeah. That's how those things go, man. Yeah, what was it, a 24 SCU of Altruzia Toxin we had to leave? Yep. Yikes. Well, it was either that or leave, it was either that or leave Weevil X. Which choice would you have made? Hmm. The Weevil X. Exactly. Weevil X. I mean, those gasping Weevil X were two mil by themselves, and then the Altruzian Toxin was kind of... How's this server been running? It's had a couple hiccups, but it's been okay until you said something. How's your rep, Pivis? Let me see. Seventy-five uh, percent. Getting closer. You haven't done much today. No, but but to be fair, the A ninety fiasco was worth yeah. the million credits. I feel like that. I'm guessing that probably took like an hour to deal with. Yeah, it did, but it was absolutely yeah. worth the profit. And then, what did we have after? We had a few. Did we do? We've taken out a couple 890s and a hammerhead today. And then we had yeah. that, we had that one where it was a uh, redeemer and then another bounty spot on top of us while we were in the middle of the fight. Oh yeah, I hated that one because there was two, um, there's an M2 and a C2 there and I wanted to see what was inside them. Pippus, accept. Accept what? That contract he just shared. I, I, I didn't get a pop-up. Share again, plus. It has oh, been shared again. Ah, my, uh, no death market here. I wonder if my shit went into local inventory at Everest. Probably. Well, no, it would have been local wherever you respawned. But it wasn't. Oh. Neither was Dime's armor. Mine was. I would wager you probably lost your stuff. I would wager I probably did, but I can land on the pad here and access the local inventory and just check. Oh, 
Oh, hiccups. Or, theoretically, I could land on the pad if people weren't fucking assholes. And shove them off, you're bigger. Nah, you can fit there. Yeah, I know the game ate my stuff. It's my target. Another 890. I'll be fine in the white suit for the rest of the day. The sperm suit. Davis. Accept. Accept it. The only reason I'm wearing armor at all is just so I have a backpack. Yeah. Well, the reason I, I like the way the, marsh, the marshmallow armor looks. And also when Dime tries to roast me on the outside of a rock, I can survive. Yeah, but I don't try to roast you on the outside of the rock very often. No, you don't. Game, I don't need to jump to Hurston. I'm in Hurston orbit. Come down here and fly shit for me. I gotta get up. Hi. We track the right target. Maybe not get any closer than 400 kilometers.
try that and try the dropping. Okay. Time to fly for 400 kilometers. Piloting. Oh, you're fine. We don't appear to have gotten much closer. No. You're having trouble? No. Well, I wasn't paying attention to our altitude, so you might want to check that. Well, let me get up off the floor again. I did try to plot a route to jump over it, see if I could drop it, but it, I didn't want to get in this turret. Uh, it wouldn't let me. Well, not surprising. Like I said earlier, I, I think I think I know why. I, I might try the Cuddy or something at the end of the stream, just randomly to see if I'm right, but I think I know what's going on with the Connie and why I can't cut jump short. Yeah, I couldn't eat plot, like I plotted the route and it wouldn't give me a marker, so. Well. I didn't try too hard. Oh, fuck. Why am I so sleepy? Oh yeah, I stayed, up, I stayed up till 5am hyper-focusing. Whoops. Yeah, I've noticed, Looney, because I try to do the same thing you do and use the power button. Yeah. Uh, the Connie doesn't power off half the time. Like, it just straight won't fucking turn off. Like, even when you land, so... Thinking that might be part of the reason why I can't get that to work right. That's why I said I might try something with the Cuddy later. One surprise, man. Anyone got a Cutter Rambler I can take a look at? Oh, is that like the Space Camper? Yeah. The only thing I can picture in my mind when anybody talks about that ship is the, um... This shit from space balls. Yeah, yeah. Literally a space Winnebago.
do, 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 just flying alone. Maybe Looney will kill a target by the time we get in range, Ben. Mm-hmm. What is Looney flying today? Tommy. Although if this sword was running well, I might try the Eclipse, maybe. What I might try is getting in close and dumb firing a torpedo at something. Ah, yes. Can we play Star Wars music and uh, pretend it's a trench run when you do it? Probably not. It won't last that long. Uh, I'll probably get blown up way too soon. One could hope. No service, you say? What? That's a lie. My dead bolts are down to not much ammo. There we go. I've just received a package delivered by a bit. Ooh! I'm not I want a bit package. I'm not sure what's in it because I'm not expecting anything. Late birthday gift? That would be a very late birthday gift. Um, I'm gonna need my scissors that Bit always makes fun of. Why does Bit make fun of your scissors? She says they're baby scissors. Yo, oh, dime has got baby scissors. They're, Are they tiny? They're little scissors that fit inside my desk drawer. I mean, you can put big scissors in a desk drawer. I... At one point, I had three pairs of scissors in my desk drawer. I don't know where oh. they are now. Bit. They're spread out on my walls. Because we came in a set of three. You can come take this for godforsaken box back. <laughs> what's in it? Because I don't want what's in it. What is in it? I don't want to deal with it. Did you hear that? Did no. You hear her? No. She came and looked at what I was holding up and went, nope, that's all you, and turned around and walked away. What are you holding? <laughs> uh, it's a replacement smoke CO2 detector for upstairs. Okay. That's a good thing. It is a good yeah. thing, but these are also hardwired into the electrical, so... Also a good thing? A little, yes, but they're also very annoying to replace. Yeah. So. I think the smoke tech detectors in my house was, was supposed to be replaced, but haven't been. Wait, she looked at it and she went, nope, nope, not dealing with it, too short. <laughs> it's a good defense. It, it it's a good, is defense. good defense. Well, she could sit on your shoulder. That's not OSHA compliant, Benis. I never said it would be. They don't have OSHA in Narnia. No. I've seen the way Will builds. That doesn't need need for OSHA.
All right, Ben. We may actually see a target sometime soon. Hopefully. We'd be nice. waiting on the Eclipse to claim. Two and a half minutes! Claim we go. Hammerhead. Six hundred uh, eyes. C2. Alright, hammerhead. All right, we can safely concentrate on the hammerhead. Oh, Chunk, I was looking at other stuff for us to do while Ben's up here. Um, there's an escape room here in Charlotte that looks like it's got some interesting stuff. Eh. Not a big fan of escape rooms? Eh. There's a, it has a Scooby-Doo themed version. Yeah. Okay. Y'all can go. <laughs> that sort of thing has no appeal to me whatsoever. But, but you can brute force it by throwing Venice at the walls until she breaks through. Venice will break before the walls do. The walls do. Okay. That is true. What about axe throwing? I am interested in axe throwing. Oh yeah, give me axes. I think there is a place like that around here. I'll ask Max. I'm up for whatever. Look, like it's a horrible idea to give things. What could possibly go on? Great idea. I feel like giving bit axes might actually be the more dangerous idea. <laughs> I was gonna say, uh... I'm just. Incapable, so I'm more likely to hurt myself. Bit now, bit would be dangerous. Getting some lag. Those last missiles never. Uh... Jeez, Oh god, it oh just disappeared. Boy. I I think it just smashed into the C2. Okay, it's back to smooth flying. I think just took a huge hit from the Rattlers. Mm -hmm. I actually kind of like this bug where I can't hear your turret firing. <laughs> Except. Accepted it. 
That's the hammerhead gone. Actually, where did that go? Blah. That's the ground. No, we're still a kilometer and a half up. Oh. No, we're not. The altitude indicator is just warped. I was going to say, it pretty much looked like you bounced my head off the ground then. What is a sea level altimeter? Yeah. That hammerhead's got no cargo. Is it warning? There's a location on Lyria called Buckets. Is that one called Spades? I doubt. Oh. I'm gonna attempt to use it as a point B to drop out of QT early. Success! Congratulations, Yay. sir! I'm 73 kilometers off the target. 73 kilometers from my certain death. Well, no, Chonkaside would be the ideal outcome of killing the target with a dumb torpedo. <laughs> Let me turn the shields off. Oh, are you going full stealth mode? Yep. How does that work? Do you just have to suppress as much energy and heat output as you can? Pretty much. Please proceed to assign landing bay. Because I've noticed that, like, the, um... One of the displays, the MFDs I can see on the county right now, has a little button that says suppress overall IR. Yeah. It makes you start to overheat, doesn't it? Or... Something. Why not have a fucking? Why does it default to comms instead of target info? It's so stupid. Target's a redeemer. I'll try locking on with one. Hitting a redeemer with a dumb fire is not likely. No. Yeah, the station's still shooting at something. I think it's bug, because it's been shooting at something all day. Yep. Oh. Well, there you go, Bip. <laughs> Yay! It works, you just need the proper strategy for it, is what I'm gathering. We'll see if I do it again. One torpedo just completely wiped that thing off the face of the planet, huh? Yeah, Redeemer's... The Redeemer is not a whole tank. Turn the shields back on. Accept, Bippus. Whoops. Did you accept, too? Mm-hmm. <laughs> you okay, Chunk? Humbling because I uh, turned the shields back on while the ship was in stealth mode, so I ran out of power. <laughs> you are clear to launch. Why do I still have a torque imbalance? Uh, increase 
increase overall power. There we go. Okay. So you can actually increase your ship's power and decrease it with F9 and F10. Oh, really? If you turn... Yeah, when you uh, turn your shields off to reduce your power output and then click the stealth button, it brings your power down to stealth levels. If you then turn your shields back on, guess what? Your power hasn't been turned back up, but your shields are using power. <laughs> and your ship's running out of battery. Yeah, and your thrusters don't work. Alright, contracts, offers, bounty hunter! Don't have another ERT. I'm gonna go back to buy Ginny and buy another torpedo, I guess. Let's see if I get an ERT. I do enjoy flying the ship, it's cool as fuck. Pretty narrow field of view, vertically. Mm. Width wise, yeah. the glass goes back behind the pilot, but. Vertical, it's pretty bad, actually. That's the thing I really like about the MSR is vertically you can see, like, behind you. Yeah, I like the Connie's cockpit. I mean, some of the struts are absolutely in the way, but you do have a decent feel over here. Oh, yeah. Let's see here. Videos, captures. Is that what I'm looking for? Yes. But yeah, once I get to about 6 mil, I'll probably buy a Corsair. There is nothing. We're we're actually in the best spot we could be in right now for this. Yeah. There's the cockpit view of the ship. Oh. It's a little bit narrow. A bit. Oh well, yeah. You got enough flippy switches above your head? Oh god yeah. Although none of them do anything. <laughs> I was gonna say, are there any of them useful? No. There is the uh, exit cockpit button up there. Although that's not actually a button, it's just an interaction prompt. Can I see if I can use Bajini's pads? How far am I from a Corsair? I'm like halfway to a Corsair. How much do they cost? About six million. Let me double check. Hey, yeah, never mind. I'm not using the pads to buy Jimmy. Holy fuck. Full of assholes. Yeah. Just gonna go get a hanger. Yeah, I'm at 4.3 mil. I'm at 6.7 after buying this ship. This thing was like 7 mil. Uh, the Corsair is 6.5. It's not bad. Yeah, that. It sounds like a reasonable upgrade from the um, Cutty Black. It is. Heavily armed, decent hull health, good shields. M maneuverable. I should say very it's, heavily armed for its class. And still some cargo space. Well, it's got a decent amount of cargo space. It does have pretty good cargo space. It's like 70 something SCU, I think. Yeah. God, I just remember Dime absolutely launching his rock into the back of my MSR the other day. <laughs> <laughs> like, you got air and bounced off the back wall. It's going to be interesting. We're going to pay more, pay a lot more attention to cargo types in the next update because things like, you know, like what we saw with the Connie not being able to take all those boxes today, even though it should have been able to numbers-wise hold that much. Yeah. And then the way we stack, it'll matter what goes where in the cargo bank. Yeah. I think. The yeah, MSR. Is just a big square cargo bay. I think the Corsair is the same, just a smaller square cargo bay. The Caterpillar is surprisingly annoying. Is it surprising? Is it surprising? It is, because it does just look like it should be a big cube in each, or rectangle in each section, but then they have to have shit hanging everywhere. 
and the ladders. Can I even take the really, really long boxes? Yes. Mm. Okay, cool. The, the easiest way to load the caterpillar is actually going to be to get the biggest boxes you can. I mean, that's generally the way it goes. Why am I going out, time? Because we're dropping the guns because we're 25 kilometers from target. Okay. Yeah, I know it doesn't you know. look like that because there's nothing but blackness <laughs> below us, but... And, you, you know, you can drop out without breaking my brain. Where's the fun in that? I fly this ship the same way Chong flies. When we drop to guns, you ass better be prepared. There's no my slowing down before we go to guns. You dropped to guns uh, earlier than I do, though. Yeah, I'm a little more cautious than you are sometimes. Corsair. A2. Starlifter, Corsair, Starfarer, and a Connie. Connie, of course. Which one's the target? Uh, the target is the A2. The A2. Nice. If you can keep that alive, that'd be great. Yeah, let's it's... kill the Connie first, then the Corsair. See if I can fudge quantum again. Might have been late on that, but it works. Ah, that's good enough. 117 kilometers. down. Get on that Corsair. Yep. Where is he? There he is. Does the dance? I'll let him live. <laughs> we were dating my friend to get a Charlie the Unicorn um, tattoo the other day. Why? <laughs> why not? But why? Because he wants all his friends to. Um, Mock him incessantly for the rest of his life? No, suggest a tattoo for him to have. You, you need to come up with a tattoo for the point, right? I think stealth may have been my problem yesterday. Oh, really? I, I wasn't using it.
Yep. Ship is powered back up. Back in the nav. Like I got down to like nine kilometers from that target before launching the torpedo. And the first like few weeks, maybe like month that I was playing, I had that happen to me once from a pirate or a griefer. Just find the Connie along, and then suddenly there's a torpedo head in my way, and then boom, I'm dead. That wasn't torpedoes who flew faster, now they're easy to shoot down. Uh, he just disappeared from me? Oh no, there he is. Whoop, there it is. Whoop, whoop, it's the sound of the police. Whoop, whoop. We went boom. Yeah, we're soft dead. How did you die? Corsair. Do you want me to try to come help with that bounty? Yep. Let's see. I'll try to come find y'all without you sharing it with me. We're in the party. You should be able to. Yeah. Are you trying... Where are you going, Dime? He's going for the fighter, if it's still there. Oh no. Which it is. He's leaving you to die, Venice. <laughs> Watch that thing explode as soon as it detaches from the ship. Oh yeah, how do I undock this? Undock, there it is. Oh yeah, you just hold in, buddy. <laughs> hold in and hold on to your butt. <laughs> right. Ship looks like it's tumbling a little bit. Yep, gravity's changing direction a lot. Uh... Oh yeah, the Connie's in soft death, so there's no gravity anymore. What altitude are you at? Hey, you gotta turn the power on first if you haven't already. I, I did. And probably also turn on the engines if you didn't. Is oh, is it stuck? Uh, if holding in doesn't work, try tapping in. I found the ground! <laughs> did, did ship survive? Oh, Dime got ejected. <laughs> That's hilarious. That was good. No, oh, but he didn't survive. Okay. No, it was. <laughs> How are you, Bittis? Uh, very dead because as it nose dived into the ground, I finally fell through the door, so I landed on the glass of the cockpit just as it hit the ground. Nice. So, I was at the crumple zone. Well, I mean, let me just go ahead and share that contract with you so we can at least get some rip off of it. Yep. Gotta wait for you to respawn first. I'm respawned. At area 18. Yikes. There you go. Accepted. Felice Darnell. Feliz Navidad. I mean, that's... Poor Sarah was real hurting, too. That's my fault for turning back in and being greedy. I knew our shields weren't fully back up, and I did it anyways. Yeah, I can still shoot it when you're not facing it. Yeah. Don't forget, you can adjust the power to each shield quadrant. Yeah, and I keep forgetting that. Okay. Well, I'll be arriving at Hurston in a little bit. I'm eight gigameters out. Quantum fuel at 75%. Love how the Aegis computer sounds. Sounds kind of like a wharf. It does. Oh god. Dime boss just a floating backpack. Neat. Cool trick.
Well, that's interesting. But This is my old armor with my shit on it, but... Aha, now it's giving me back my stuff. Because this backpack wasn't here last time I respawned in um, Area 18. Migration. My stuff's still on that planet, though. We'll go get your shit. Yeah. I think if I had pulled back fast enough, like pulled pulled down, that um, Merlin might have survived that because it got ejected, and then before I could really get complete control of it, it was on the ground, and I didn't jerk the mouse back for quick enough. I don't know, probably not though. It was probably too much velocity. Oh yeah, like you might have separated. But yeah, I was still... totally, I was totally leaving you to die. I had Chonk understood what was happening as soon as he saw me making it my way through the cargo bay. Right. I thought you were just going to jump out and try and, I don't know, live on your own. I forgot that He was going to do a sweet it. combat roll when he hit the ground to survive. Right, superhero <laughs> landing. <laughs> you forget that fighter's back there, don't you, Ben? Mm-hmm. I mean, it's usable. The gun doesn't visually exist, although it does shoot. Oh god, there's no quantum marker for this guy? Why? I'll try HDMS Perlman. Let's see how close that gets me. Eighty-eight kilometers. Dayside. Nice. Oh, it was Dayside when we were there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I do enjoy the atmospheric effects in this game. I've got some really pretty screenshots in the last couple days. Mm -hmm. What was the target again? The A2? Yep. Yeah. That Corsair is real hurt, by the way. Probably just gonna kill the A2 and bug out. What about my corpse? You can come get it. Y'all are just gonna have to kill the other stuff because I'm Did flying a ship that has torpedoes and two tiny guns. Hmm. Your insurance claim has been Fair enough. That's fine. That means like, if uh, if they don't react when I kill the A2, then I might try the others. That's if I kill the A2. Well, that probably means that once we get land, get into uh, orbit, you need to take over, Ben, because you'll be able to see. It. Well, no, I should have a death marker there too, shouldn't I? Yep. Yeah, and you hit the ground, uh, so it's probably there. Yeah, but I was just wearing a sperm suit. Hi. Do 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 do. You are looking for the car. Yeah, I should be there unless the there. wreckage pushed me through the ground. It'll be interesting. <laughs> Excuse me. <coughs> See how far away from you I am. Hey. Yeah. Try the vehicle tunnel. Fifteen kilometers from the target. Welcome. Do -do 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 -do. Shields are down. I'm in stealth. Please visit us again. Goodbye. Gonna park about nine kilometers out. Thank you. Torpedo away. For the latest travel information, be sure to check the departure and arrival boards. I killed something, but it wasn't the target. The hell was that? What were the other ships there? There was the Corsair. The A2, and that would have been something else. It was it Starfarer, I think? Uh, yes. Do you remember the name of the uh, ships? Nope. All that's left is Felice and Carlton. 
Carlton was, was the Corsair, I think. Yeah, so the Corsair's alive. So it would been the staff arrow that you hit? Target's dead. Yeah. Uh, you hit whatever the third ship was. It yeah, it was dead. between me and the A2. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Incredibly unlucky. Yeah, all that's left is the uh, Corsair. 80.8%. You got one more torpedo. <laughs> no, I don't. I had two left. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I wonder how close I can get before it notices me. There's no chance that anything you shot is uh, gonna survive, because it's hard kill, right? Oh no, yeah, they're toast. <laughs> I haven't yet seen that explosion from up close, but I'd wager it's pretty large. I mean, shoot, I could probably go restock and then come back. Everest, route... I mean, shoot, I just got within five kilometers of the Corsair and it didn't even notice me. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval. Please visit us again. Goodbye. Oh, it's only doing a little dance instead of a big dance. Oh, that's good. Stand by. Hangar 4. Like the way I got an elevator immediately, and then I looked, and you didn't follow me, so I just left. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then your elevator still didn't come. Hello. Hello. Well, oh, you fell through the floor. Yeah, that's a problem with the uh, county elevator. Eleven K for three torpedoes. <coughs> oh shit! Right. Hmm. I killed the target. There's no more uh, marker for that location. You'll have to follow us in or wait for us. Oh, you could probably pick up another bounty in the time it take us to get back there. I mean, y'all can just pop that Corsair and be okay, so... Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Bounty! ERT! Pippus! Yep. Except... Except it.
Were we on Hurston or Magda for that, Ben? Uh, Magda. 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 There's a new, uh, new commercial they've been showing on uh, YouTube TV that's for um, one of the animation blocks that has, like, you know, Family Guy and, and all that. Yeah. And, Futurama. and it starts with Peter naked in a wig on top of a wrecking ball. It's so the first, yeah, my tracks. Yeah, so the first time I saw it, I stopped it and rewound and told Megan I needed to come, her to come in here and watch something. And I started playing it, and she looked at me, and she goes, why? I said, because if I had to suffer through it, somebody else has to, too. <laughs> Think back about Family Guy. There are so many really wrong things, and they're like, when they're they're working from home or whatever and Chris and Peter are talking about Meg and they're like he's like yeah but she's just off his hot like not hot hot <laughs> Johnny Vigoli oh one of his wingmen Six kilometers from the target. Torpedo away. <clears throat> go, torpedo, go. It's like a couple of star fares, a Connie of some sort, and an A2. Kaboom. Kaboom. I love that stealth is actually already a functional mechanic in this game. <laughs> I think this is a viable option. I'll just pull up in visual distance where I can look and see what these ships are without locking onto them and still not be seen. <clears throat> Never tried it. It is very cool that it is functional, though. I mean, the problem is in a ship the size of a Connie, it doesn't work very well, probably. No, There's I probably don't. a chart somewhere that tells you what the uh, thresholds are and everything, what, you, what distance you're visible at. I've given everything else around this game, I'm quite sure there are. Go back to Everest until it gives me another ERT. Could relocate to Microtech. Because we're going to be pulling the same bounties out here now. Although, given what time it is, y'all might be time to wrap up by the time you'll get your stuff. Yeah. By the time she gets her stuff, I'm good. Yeah. I'll probably get one or two more ERTs in. Probably. Well, while we're flying down there, I'm going to look through my ERTs and see if there just happens to be something. Or even a VHRT, something on Magda. Oh, God, don't. Why am I blacking out? I don't know, because Magda. we're pulling zero Gs right now. Nope. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Desync is the only thing I can tell you. Yep. You have been flying through a lot of space stations today. Haven't hit one yet. That's a group ERT. I tend to just have those just constantly, and you said you haven't seen them very often, Chunk. Yeah. Recently. I just seem to always have one.
The only ERT you've got? It is. Well, there is a VHRT here on Magda. That's better than nothing, and we can probably get it done, so I'm going to accept it and share it. Uh, we got to find and apprehend rich dicks. Nice. Yeah. Dick Dicks? You've got to assume his name is Richard. Mm. So his name is definitely Dick Dicks. You reckon he's a small animal that looks like a deer? I don't know. Do you reckon his parents hated him as much as NASCAR driver Dick Trickle? Probably, yeah. <laughs> you can't call it. Mind you, I did go to school with someone called Donald Donaldson. <laughs> you ever wonder if somebody with a name like that at one point just looks at their parents and says, Come on. You knew what the nickname was. What were you thinking? Or did you just not care? Probably didn't want a kid. I just feel sorry for, like, 30 or 40 odd years ago when it was common to name your first child as the same name as the father. Which is fine if your first child is fun. If your first child was a daughter, you still named after your father, you just could put Ina at the end. So you had Donald Ina, Angus Ina. <laughs> that seems like a very Scottish problem. It does. Mm -hmm. Bibbis, except. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm. Masaru Raindrop Pixley. I'm sorry, what? You heard That's what she spit. <laughs> Plus, I bet Corsair's probably already gone. See any targets now, Ben? Where's your death marker? You're pointed right at it. Should be about the same. Twelve k away. Okay. I must not have bounced very far then. It didn't look like it. Ah, there were the bits of Corsair. You mean Connie? Connie, yes. <laughs> yeah, you just pierced me a little bit up the hill from where my marker is. Yep, there I am on the ground. I'm a little white dot. Landing complete. Take off. Weather sucks out there, Ben. Oh boy! Target. Yeah, it's a little dusty. It'll be right.
I see the reflection of my wonderful bronze body. <laughs> Must have been a real expensive spray tan. <laughs> That button. Swap. <coughs> yes. Swap. Wait, you still got my. Give me my med gun. And that. And those. Alright. Which oh bit of Connie do I go to? They all look the same. Hurry up, you bum. Alright. It's your fault. Torpedo away. Got two Hercules, a Caterpillar, and a Redeemer. You dick. Demon shot the torpedo down. Food. Right, let's go find these targets, Dinebot. Let's locate the rich dicks. <laughs> oh, goodness. Do you think he's a sugar daddy? No, answering that question. <laughs> well, I think that he's that he's not near anything. Do some quick googling. That's as good as that's going to get. But with high enough altitude, we'll be able to get to max speed real fast. Mm-hmm. Okay. Warp. Oh, I'm too close. Shit, right. I have to be fucking torpedoes. Five kilometers limit. You're too stealthy, Chunk. I mean, yeah, I got to, like, four kilometers out. I was like, oh right, I can't fire this close. Hey! Torpedo away, completely different position and closer. It's already shooting at it. The fuck is this shit? Time to find out how close I can get before they react, and I'll just dumb fire a torpedo at it from even closer. Will they dumb fire? Say it again? That's a, they, they'll actually dumb fire for you? Pretty sure, yeah. We're about to find out. <clears throat> Maybe it's the expensive chunk. That do be the chunk way of doing things. 
Jesus Christ, this thing is super fucking stealthy. I'm 2.2 kilometers from the target. I mean, it's a stealth bomber. Yeah. Do -do. <laughs> Do -do. Oh, but it doesn't fly straight if you dumb fire it. Really? Uh, it aimed down a little bit. Time to skedaddle! <clears throat> yeah, that thing just has a turret gunner that's too, uh, too alert. Mm. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. He's been drinking that liquid death. Jesus Christ, apparently I got clipped on the way through them. Lost my right wing. Still have the thrusters on that wing, so I'm good in space. We'll see how I do when I try to land this thing. Got an M2, and which Dex is in a star forever. And a C2. Get me to rock Can't do that. I heard the missile noise, but didn't see any. Oh, there they go. We've got some interesting lag happening. Yep. Yeah, I'm trying to jump and it's not doing it. There it goes. Ah! <laughs> we had a chunk event then. Front shields are down. Yeah, I'm turning away. I see another hail of bullets fly towards us. It's really hard to track something that's not flying smoothly. Yes, it is. Hey, 
Can I move, please, now that I'm out of QT? Don't think so. on this kind of gonna keep it a hell of a lot of fire. Yep. You lucky this time, Bernard Rodenberg. Oh, that C2 survived as well. I know the bit will get mad if you're too late. Well, and I'm also I... the one cooking dinner tonight, so. No, oh, I lost a wing, and the repair only cost 480 credits. Jesus. <laughs> this one cheap ass wing. Well, it doesn't have any thrusters on it. True. At least it, I, it broke off like just past where the thrusters are. Well, Biff, what did we get you up to today? Have a look, see. Rep. Bounty Hunters, 83.3%. Not bad, considering that we had a little bit of an adventure in the first hour or so of the stream. I mean, yeah, but the first hour of the stream got us over a million credits. So. Yeah, I mean... Still no, uh, still no cert there? For the no, I'm about two-thirds of the way towards the cert. Well, I mean, look okay. at your mission list and just make sure to... Right. I, mean, I believe that we are correct about when it'll pop, but you never know. Pin Ranger Clep, that's her name. Caden Dimples Daily. <laughs> no, half my bounty is currently entrenched, but. Um, we're not looking at too much no, more sure. work to get you to um, ERTs. No, I mean, getting about 10% each day we do this. And, it's like two more days. And from what you were saying, Looney, and, and what I understand, once we get you this all the way up there, it'll be really easy for all of us to climb back up if they wipe it. Yeah, it should be. Nice. As long as it continues functioning the way as expected. A few more big loads of weevil eggs and I can get a cool serve as well. That was a nice landing. Hmm. So what's uh, what's on the board for tomorrow then? More of this? Probably. Yeah, I don't I don't know if I I might go out tomorrow. I don't know yet. I'm, I'll probably be home around the same time. I'm sure. That's it. We're being scanned right now. Yeah. I'm good. It's all right. The criminal is leaving the ship. When point two four comes out, I can shoot you right now, Dan. You could. All right, as we wrap up, 
more bounty hunting tomorrow. Yay! Until Bye. then, everybody have a nice night. Bye! Bye! Bye. All right.